Introducing Cell One's new share plans, perfect for families and friends. For only $89, two people share unlimited in-network calling, unlimited BlackBerry social, and a bunch of anytime minutes and text messages. Plus, you can add your boy or anyone else for only $9. Cell One, the power of more. Hello and welcome to our Christmas edition of News Bite, the Bermuda Sun's weekly news wrap-up for Friday, December 23rd, brought to you in association with Cell One. I'm Michaela Pearman. Stay tuned for a world-exclusive video interview with Santa Claus. But first, our top story. Electronic ankle bracelets were issued for the first time in Magistrate's Court this week. 18-year-old Troy Huey agreed to wear the first tag when he was given bail for allegedly assaulting a police officer. Kenneth Keynes, Kawande Lathan, Terence Christopher, Skya Ferbert, Andy Silva, Jermaine Lovell, and Javon Whitfield were next to be given the electronic tags after they denied wounding two men. Senior Magistrate Archibald Warner told the defendants they must wear the tags 24 hours a day and stay inside their homes. The Electronic Monitoring Act was passed in the Senate last week. In holiday news, a secret Santa paid off layaway bills for strangers at the Phoenix's toy and kids clothing departments. The anonymous center represented a group of people who didn't want to be named. Phoenix President George Grundmuller praised the donor's Christmas spirit. He declined to say how much the bill was, but said it was substantial. Our readers praised the gesture, saying, that is awesome, the true spirit of Christmas. And this is the type of behavior that I'd like to see copied. There is hope for humanity. The dispute between KFC and the BIU is set to go to arbitration, said union boss Chris Febert. BIU members picketed the restaurant after management announced it would scrap the collective bargaining agreement. Mr. Farbert said the workers remain adamant they wanted the BIU to represent them. KFC says it's willing to negotiate for a new contract. A 38-year-old man was shot in the East Avenue area of Southampton this week. His injuries are not thought to be life-threatening. Meanwhile, a 24-year-old man was shot outside the Gravity nightclub in Devonshire. He has been airlifted to the States for specialized treatment. Families Minister Glenn Blakeney said he knows from personal experience the devastation caused by Bermuda's escalating gang violence. His son, Jamal Blakeney, was jailed last week for 30 years, along with Sanjay Grant, for the Southside shooting of Shakai Miners and Renee Kuchler. Minister Blakeney made the comment in response to Boulevard Blazers withdrawing from a Friendship Cup football match against Somerset Trojans because of safety concerns. Just in time for Christmas, I caught up with Santa via Skype this week at his workshop in the North Pole. Here's what he had to say about his annual visit to Bermuda. So Santa, not every home in Bermuda has a chimney for you to climb down. What's your solution? Well, of course, I've got many secrets about how I managed to get into people's homes. I have uh, magic keys, of course, but I, I found one of the best things in Bermuda is your lovely pink sand. So I have a great supply of that. I found it very magical indeed. And I sprinkle a little bit of that uh, over the uh, chimney tops. And if you, of course, don't have chimneys, <laughs> that helps as well. That 35% duty on imports has got to be a stinger this year, right? Oh, my goodness me. Mrs. Claus, you told me nothing about the 35%. I was still working it out at 25%. I shall have to recalculate before Christmas Eve, of course. Thank you so much, Santa. And may I just say in closing, Michaela, a very Merry Christmas to you and all the wonderful people of your island in Bermuda and all the wonderful people there at the Bermuda Sun as well. <laughs> a Merry Christmas from all of us at the North Pole. Happy Holidays. Thanks to Santa for taking time out of his very busy schedule to chat with us. You can watch the rest of our interview with Santa at bermudasun.bm. Also in news this week, a 21-year-old man was charged with four counts of accessing child pornography. He was released on bail. Drivers who use cell phones while on the road will now face fines of up to $1,000 and driving bans. And a carpet of sargasm seaweed on Bermuda's beaches and bays is natural and will break down over time, scientists told us. In sports, the holiday is all about football games with the friendship finals. On Boxing Day, there will be a doubleheader at the Southampton Oval with Hamilton Parish playing social club at noon and Devonshire Cougars taking on Somerset Trojans at 2 p.m. 
On Tuesday, the games would take place at the Wellington Oval, with Crossroads and Flanagan's playing at noon and St. David's taking on North Village at 2 p.m. The winners will play each other on New Year's Day. In weather news, expect partly cloudy skies on Christmas Eve and Christmas Day with temperatures in the high 60s and low 70s. And finally this weekend, if all that Christmas fare hasn't forced you into a food coma, there are plenty of parties planned for the holiday. Tonight, there are parties at Docksiders, Moon, and Rum Bar. On Christmas Eve, revelers can head to the Wine Cellar and Docksiders, while Christmas night, people can celebrate again at Rum Bar. And on Boxing Day, there are parties at Pier 6, on the Uber Vita, and at Moon and LV's. That's all for this week. Catch me on Channel 82 over the weekend. For these stories and more, visit BermudaSun.bm. Newsbite was brought to you in association with Cell One. Special thanks to VSB TV 11 and the Annex Toys, who made our video chat with Santa possible. From all of us at the Bermuda Sun, we wish you a very Merry Christmas. Have a wonderful holiday, and most importantly, be safe. I'm Michaela Pearman. See you next Friday. Introducing Cell One's new share plans, perfect for families and friends. For only $89, two people share unlimited in-network calling, unlimited BlackBerry social, and a bunch of anytime minutes and text messages. Plus, you can add your boy or anyone else for only $9. Cell One, the power of more.